I just, I have video ideas, but then, I don't know, then I just, I'm like, wait, would that be really boring? And then I don't do it. So, I don't know, I just start contemplating my life. I'm not funny enough to post anything like Sarah Vasca. She can literally post a video of her brushing her teeth and I would watch it in a heartbeat and I would laugh so much. I was thinking today and I was like, what would they want to watch? What would I watch? But I watch Dr. Phil all the time, so like. So I'm gonna do a makeup tutorial. Don't know what I'm gonna do. I think the only reason I don't like doing makeup tutorials is because I don't feel like I'm not a beauty guru. Um, I just like posting. Sorry, that was gross. <laughs> oh my god, that fell. Earlier I was trying to wash my concealer off. My eyes started burning and I was like, like what's going on? But then I remembered that I'm dumb and I put soap on my eyelashes this morning so I was like oh it might work with, it works with my eyebrows and it should work with my eyelashes and <laughs> don't do that oh yeah okay so I did my eyebrows and I also like prime my eyelids that's why I kind of look kind of weird I'm gonna do this one because I don't really use it much and I want to start using it more because I really like it with my Morphe E27 brush Tina Halalda uses this brush so I'm gonna use it this orange I always feel like my transition color is like too much but extra I'm gonna go with this morphe m505 brush it's like brownish one I'm gonna focus that in my crease but I'm also gonna bring it up just a little bit to make the other one look more blended I guess okay so then I'm gonna go in again with this brush and then I'm gonna go in with a really darker brown shade and we're gonna see if that works in my crease and we're also gonna kind of bring it in like at the outer right there I got uglier. What was I? Okay. I'm gonna go with this Anastasia Beverly Hills brush. It's like from the Modern Essence palette. I'm gonna go with the same color and like go more in my crease because this is a smaller brush. Oh, I was living on that. I want to go in with this darker shade and then that one together with my Morphe M506 brush. And then every now and then I just kind of go in with my E27 brush and I kind of like brush over all of the layers so it kind of like blends better. I don't know why I bought it because I thought it would be bigger like an actual highlighting brush. It's actually just super small. The Morphe E40. And then I'm going to go with my concealer that I use for everything. I'm gonna use this NYX glitter. I went in with the Bulk Glitters Bitty Jar, the orange, Orbit Orange, the B7. And um, I don't really know much about glitter because I never tried it before, before this. And um, with my experience so far, I mean, I really like them. They make makeup look a lot more professional, I guess. I'm trying out this CoverGirl all, Last All Day Concealer in Fair. Going in with the Anastasia Contour Kit in Light to Medium because I'm so white. And I'm gonna go in with the middle shade thing. And I'm gonna go in with these two Morphe brushes, this big poofy fan brush, and then this little contour medium brush thing. I'm gonna curl my eyelashes with this little Walmart eyelash curler with the L'Oreal Voluminous False Fiber Lashes, the waterproof one. I'm going to go in with the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and Milk and then I'm gonna waterline my eyes with them. The Anastasia Glow Kit and I'm gonna spray with my NYX Matte 
finish mats for everything before so it stays so that was it for this makeup tutorial kind of thing um i really like losing glitter and i feel like this eyeshadow looks kind of cool even though it's kind of basic i just kind of like it and also it's a mess my voiceover is kind of weird i started doing it like in the middle of the whole video so sorry about that um but yeah i hope you guys enjoy this nubian palette slash glitter look good thing so yeah subscribe and like i'll see you guys in my next video and bye